Unit 7, The World of Work. A, A Student's Work. 1. Listen, then practice with a partner. Pages 76 and 77. 'Eat your breakfast, Wa. It's half past six. You'll be late for school. I won't be late, Uncle. I'm usually early. Our classes start at seven o'clock. And what time do your classes finish? At quarter past eleven. Then I do my homework assignments. That takes about two hours each day. You work quite hard, Wa. When will you have a vacation? Our summer vacation starts in June. It lasts for almost three months. What will you do during the vacation? I don't know. Maybe I will go and see Mom and Dad on their farm. I always like helping them. They work very hard, but we have fun working together. A letter from America. June 1st. Dear Hua, hi, how are you? I'm fine. Thanks for your letter. I like hearing about how students live in Vietnam. I find it really interesting. I think you have fewer vacations than American students. Is that true? Our longest vacation is in the summer. Do you have a long summer vacation too? We don't have a Tet holiday, but we celebrate New Year on January 1st. Our most important vacations are Easter, 4th of July, Thanksgiving and Christmas. We usually spend time with our family on these vacations. What other vacations do you have? What do you like doing during your vacations? Please write soon and tell me. Your friend, Tim. Tim enjoys all the public holidays. At Christmas, he always gets a lot of gifts. Thanksgiving is an important celebration and there's always turkey and lots of good food. In Tim's hometown, there is always a large fireworks display on Independence Day. Tim likes New Year because he can stay up until midnight and celebrate with his parents. Many people think that students have an easy life. We only work a few hours a day and have long vacations. They don't know we have to work hard at school and at home. Take a look at a typical grade 7 student like Hua. She has five periods a day six days a week. That is about 20 hours a week. Fewer hours than any workers. But that is not all. Hua is a keen student and she studies hard. She has about 12 hours of homework every week. She also has to review her work before tests. This makes her working week about 45 hours. This is more than some workers. Students like Hua are definitely not lazy. Unit 7. The World of Work A. A Student's Work 1. Listen, then practice with a partner. Eat your breakfast, Hua. It's half past six. You'll be late for school. I won't be late, Uncle. I'm usually early. Our classes start at seven. And what time do your classes finish? At a quarter past eleven, then in the afternoon I do my homework. That takes about two hours each day. You work quite hard, Hua. Huh? When will you have a vacation? Our summer vacation starts in June. It lasts for almost three months. What will you do during the vacation? I'll go see Mom and Dad on their farm. I always like helping them. They work very hard, but we have fun working together. 2. Read. Then answer the questions. A letter from America. June 1st. Dear Hua. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. Thanks for your letter. I like hearing about how students live in Vietnam. I find it really interesting. I think you have fewer vacations than American students. Is that true? Our longest vacation is in summer. Do you have a long summer vacation too? We don't have a Tet holiday, but we celebrate the New Year on January 1st. Our most important vacations are Easter, 
Fourth of July, Thanksgiving, and Christmas. We usually spend time with our families on these vacations. What other vacations do you have? What do you like doing during your vacations? Please write soon and tell me. Your friend, Tim. 3. Listen. Write the name of the public holiday in each of these pictures. Tim enjoys all the public holidays. At Christmas, he always gets a lot of gifts. Thanksgiving is an important celebration. And there is always turkey and a lot of good food. In Tim's hometown, there is always a large fireworks display on Independence Day. Tim likes New Year because he can stay up until midnight and celebrate with his parents. 4. Read, then answer the questions. Many people think that students have an easy life. We only work a few hours a day and have long vacations. They don't know we have to work hard at school and at home. Take a look at a typical grade 7 student like Hua. She has five periods a day, six days a week. That is about 20 hours a week. Fewer hours than any worker. But that is not all. Hua is a keen student, and she studies hard. She has about 12 hours of homework every each week. She also has to review her work before tests. This makes her working week about 45 hours. This is more than some workers. Students like Hua are definitely not lazy. B. The Worker 1. Listen and read. Then answer the questions. A letter from Tim Jones. July 3rd. Dear Hua, I am pleased that you and your family are well. I am fine too. Here is a photo of me, my mom and dad, and my sister Shannon. Can you send me a photo of you? Let me tell you more about my parents. My mom works at home. She takes care of the family. Three mornings a week she works part-time at a local supermarket. She and other women also cook lunch for homeless people once a week. My dad is a mechanic. He repairs machines in a factory. He works five days a week for about 40 hours, sometimes in the morning and sometimes in the afternoon. He prefers the morning shift. He has fewer days off than my mom. However, when he has an afternoon free, he plays golf. Dad gets about seven public holidays each year. He also has a three-week summer vacation. We always go to Florida on vacation. We have a great time and Dad plays more golf. Please write soon and tell me about your family. Best wishes, Tim. 2. Read. Hua's father, Mr. Tuan, is a farmer. He works more hours than Tim's father. He usually starts work at 6 in the morning. He has breakfast, then he feeds the buffalo, pigs, and chickens, and collects the eggs. From about 9 in the morning until 4 in the afternoon, Mr. Tuan works in the fields with his brother. They grow some rice but their main crop is vegetables. From 12 to 1 o'clock, Mr. Tuan rests and eats lunch. At 4 in the afternoon, they come back home. Mr. Tuan feeds the animals again. Then he cleans the buffalo shed and the chicken coop. His work usually finishes at 6. Four or five times a year, when there is less work, Mr. Tuan takes a day off. He goes to the city with his wife. A farmer has no real vacations. 4. Listen and take notes. Peter is a doctor in a hospital. He is on duty for about 70 hours a week. He has four weeks vacation each year. Susan is a nurse. 
She is on duty for fifty hours a week. She has three weeks vacation a year. Jane is a shop assistant. She works thirty-five hours a week. She has one week's vacation a year. Fong is a factory worker. He works forty-eight hours a week. He has an annual vacation of two weeks. Five, play with words. The future. In the future, machines will do all the work for me and you. Robots working at top speed, making all the things we need. Robot farmers will grow our crops. A robot works and never stops. We will have less work and more money to spend. A two-day week and a five-day weekend. Some people think this may come true, but I don't think it's true. Do you? A letter from Tim Jones, June third. Di Hua, I am pleased that you and your family are well. I am fine too. Here is a photo of me, my mum, and dad, and my sister Shannon. Can you send me a photo of you? Let me tell you more about my parents. My mum works at home. She takes care of the family. Three mornings a week, she works part time at a local supermarket. She and the other woman also cook lunch for homeless people once a week. My dad is a mechanic; he repairs machines in a factory. He works five days a week for about forty hours, sometimes in the morning and sometimes in the afternoon. He prefers the morning shift. He has fewer days off than my mum. However, when he has an afternoon free, he plays golf. Dad gets about seven public holidays each year. He also has a three-week summer vacation. We've always go to Florida on vacation. We have a great time, and Dad plays more golf. Please write soon and tell me more about your family. Best wishes, Tim. Hua's father, Mr. Tuan, is a farmer. He works more hours than Tim's father. He usually starts work at six in the morning. He has breakfast, then he feeds the buffalo. Pigs and chickens, and collects the eggs. From about nine in the morning until four in the afternoon, Mr. Tuan works in the fields with his brother. They grow some rice, but their main crop is vegetables. From twelve to one o'clock, Mr. Tuan rests and eats lunch. At four in the afternoon, they come back home. Mr. Tuan feeds the animals again. Then he cleans the buffalo shed and the chicken coop. His work usually finishes at six. Four or five times a year, when there is less work, Mr. Tuan takes a day off. He goes to the city with his wife. A farmer has no real vacations. Peter is a doctor in a hospital. He is on duty for about seventy hours a week. He has four weeks vacation each year. Susan is a nurse. She is on duty for fifty hours a week. She has three weeks vacation a year. Jane is a shop assistant. She works thirty-five hours a week. She has one week's vacation a year. Fom is a factory worker. He works forty-eight hours a week. He has an annual vacation of two weeks.